Hello everyone, so this is our new co-worker. This is Taylor, she's a senior at Siena. So today she is gonna take everyone through an art project. Uh, this is an art project, you can do at home, not necessarily if you, you know, if you don't have watercolor paints or paints, you can, I'm assuming, draw yep. and color. Mm -hmm. So she's gonna walk us through and walk everyone else through what we are doing. So whenever you're ready, Taylor. All right, so today we're gonna make penguins because it was really cold a couple weeks ago, remember? <laughs> So I thought it'd be fun if we made penguins. Penguins, yeah. Okay, so first, so as you can see, do you see that I have different like backgrounds kind of thing? Yeah. You don't have to do swirly lines. I did swirly lines for my background, but you can do whatever you want. You can poke it off, you can do swirly lines like this, or you can do the blank. So whatever color you want to do is so just take your paintbrushes, dip them in water first. So it's all wet. <laughs> I'll paint you, I'll paint, have you paint someone here a little bit. Okay. Can I have the paintbrushes? No. no. Oh, I opened it for you and it shut again. Sorry. I shut, I shut it. Oh, oh, why'd you shut it? Because I felt like it. Well, how are you were supposed to get it back open? I don't know. Oh, God. There you go. Thank you. You're welcome. I thought sickle does sound mighty nice right now, doesn't it? Everyone got their paintbrushes wet? No. You need to put it in the water first before you put it in the paint. What? Where? What? Oh, Gary used to say that that barbershop got you. Good? Yeah. All right, now you guys can do whatever you want for the background. The first paper we're going to use is for the background. You can use any color you want. Whatever background you want to do, go ahead. So if you want a green penguin, like Daryl's doing, Daryl's making a green penguin. Yeah. I like green. Green's good. Oh, good, good, good. Well, you actually, you know what? I'm doing a blue penguin. Blue penguin? Oh. Nice day in the morning. I got H and Bless you. All right, guys. So, if you're watching this, I mean, you don't necessarily have to use watercolor paint, but you can use paint, markers, crayons, colored pencils, do whatever you would like if you want to make a penguin. So, that being said, everyone have a great day. And we'll talk to you later.